Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm just kind of making this video in a response to a comment that I received. I'm pretty sure some of you are pretty new to the handheld market. But uh, someone asked me how do I install all these games that I have installed on my ANU 2. So pretty much for those that don't know what this is. This is a gaming PC handheld. So it works just like a regular desktop PC. You just have to install Steam, and if you have a Steam library, literally every game that you have on there, you can install. So, as you can see that there's some games like GTFO, Insurgency, Sandstorm, New World, Outriders, and etc. Pretty much anything that you have in your library, you can install here. So, pretty much on a desktop, you would go to Google, just like normal. See, this is uh, the Windows Internet Explorer. So just open that. And then if you're familiar with PC gaming, obviously most people use Steam, which is what I have. Just download that if you have Windows or Mac, depending on what you're using. And then if, once you make your account, you go to the store. And, Welcome to Sync. You'll uh, take on the nano-infested dead sectors of the Meridian in PV... Excuse that little video real quick. That's just a game that I was looking at earlier. But pretty much, you just go to the store, find a game that you like. So let's just click on, for example, let's do something I don't have. That way, I can make a better example of it. Um, let's click on the store, categories. Let's look up action RPG, just for the heck of it. Um, let's click on Dying Light 2. It's the first one that came up. View page. And then, obviously here is just playing a video as to what the game is. Blah, blah, blah. And then, obviously you just buy your game here. Add to cart. And then you just follow the steps from there. And then install it. It's pretty simple. Like I said, if you have a PC to begin with, this is a pretty simple process. But for those of you that don't know, this is a Windows gaming handheld. It's pretty pricey. Uh, I got the 32 RAM, 2 terabyte version. It's pretty good. It's, it's called the ANU 2. So if you guys are ever interested in a really good handheld that can handle pretty much anything, I re highly recommend this. I also have a... Uh, I bumped the camera real quick. Excuse the shaking in the camera. I do have a Steam Deck. It's right here. Um, I got nothing bad to say about it. But obviously... After owning the Steam Deck for a while, I really like it, and I still do. Um, usually when you get this right out of the box, you run what's called Steam OS. So that's pretty basic for those that do know. That's basically the regular operating system that you get when you buy this, the Steam OS. But obviously I went ahead and installed Windows on this too. I love the Steam OS, but I felt kind of restricted in not being able to play everything that I do like. And don't get me wrong, this kind of does play pretty much everything. But obviously it has its limitations. You can really only run it up to 15 watts of TDP. And it comes with very limited storage. So I had a friend help me out and he installed a one terabyte NVMe SSD drive. And that's pretty much my upgrade on that. But right out of the box, I got this with two terabytes. So it's really big of a difference. But uh yeah, that's pretty much how you install games onto one of these. If you have a desktop to begin with, like I said, that's a pretty simple process. But for those of you who don't know, I just figured I'd make this video and reply to that comment. I'll see you guys in the next video.